Right. They can even put uh, false memories in. They're they're practicing implanting neurons that aren't even yours. False memories. Okay, but I want you to show that again because. Uh, okay, so the question was, what were you showing me about uh, out of body experience? Mm -hmm. About the brain. So the question was, what was the question? Bye bye guys. About the consciousness. If consciousness can exist on it on a, as a phenomenon. Without the brain, own, without right? The body. So this is a, also another answer. I mean, uh, this answer is also another question of: Does the brain produce consciousness? Okay, go ahead. Okay, here. So you have the this the the synapses and these axons. You have neurons flowing through the synapses, neurons flowing through the the, the pathways in your brain. At the end of these path pathways, you have dendrites, the brain receptors, and so the neurons emit a electrical particle that shoot through these passageways and touches the brain receptors, the dendrites. And that, in these little particles of light, they're ionic particles, that is where your memory and experiences are, are stored. That's what your consciousness is made up of in these little... Part of their consciousness. They're, 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 yes, they're, there's nothing tangible in them. Yeah. They're, not, they're nothing you yeah, can you touch can, or feel. Like we don't waves. even know what they look like. Yeah. You know, you can't, there's nothing tangible about these things. that The neurons emit see. this. But when you take stuff like delirium... It's a drug that coats the brain receptors. It, it, it blocks the neuron from em it, the, the, the little electrical impulse the neuron emits to touch the brain receptor can't function properly because it's coated and so it induces an out-of-body experience. Anyone that takes okay, delirium... So, let me see. so this is brain receptor, right? Yeah, dendrites, the brain receptor. A.K.A. brain receiver, Yeah, right? brain receptor. Receiver. So it's receiving these things. It's receiving... These things you cannot the see. Neurons. They're intangible. Where are they yeah. coming from? They're coming from the neurons. The neuron emits this electrical impulse that's ionic. That's where your experiences and memory lies. And it, it, To the it physical touches, realm. Yes, it not, touches yeah. the brain receptors. And the electrical impulses then tell you, then you think, then you can think, then you can think. When the brain receptors are coated with drugs like delirium, then it they, prevents this, it, it, it makes everything go haywire. And everyone that uses delirium automatically reports an out-of-body out of body. experience. Out-of-body, oh, yeah. there's, a, there's a million experiences on a roll and you can talk about it. Just, it yeah, your consciousness shoots and you're somewhere else. Your consciousness yeah. is flowing. Some people report, some people report a... That they are con that they were an orb, with a three hundred and sixty degree light. View. They're light. They yeah. could see everything, at yeah. not just Once. one direction. They can yeah. see every which way. Their their whole consciousness. So the process the processor is higher awareness, higher consciousness. Yeah, well, it's yeah. it's something different. Like you don't have a. You know, this one lady that she had experienced a, uh, a. Out of body when she got hit. This is like NDE, the near death experience. NDE, yeah. and she saw herself under the car. As, yeah, she, yeah, yeah. as she was looking out from under the car at the yeah, same time. It's a defense mechanism.